but on a, a neurotransmitter called homovanillic acid, which is in the dopamine pathway. Now, a pet peeve of mine is when people say 90% of the serotonin is made for the gut, therefore it's good for your brain to make gut serotonin. Serotonin doesn't cross the blood-brain barrier. Homovanillic acid does. Interestingly, in humans, homovanillic acid levels are low in depression. And there's also decreased levels of the gut bugs that make this neurotransmitter. So this neurotransmitter is made in the gut, it goes yeah. to the brain, and it can alter mental function. Um, we know it's low in humans with depression. Um, and in animal models, where you can like, you know, chop off heads, do you know, brain staining, um, animal models of depression, just giving homovanillic acid or either of the gut bugs is t sufficient to reverse depression phenotypes. It can't be considered quote unquote gold standard, uh, you know, evidence-based medicine because there hasn't been a human RCT because nobody's funded and done that. But the fact, first of all, the physiology is incredible that your diet, the way you live, can change your gut bacteria. Those gut bacteria make a neurotransmitter that we know can cross the blood brain barrier and alter the mind. What more link do you need to say, yeah, what you do in your lifestyle, how you sleep, eat, live, mm -hmm. affects the mind?